let's investigate the missing find the missing convoy which is right over there search for clues regarding the attackers whereabouts nope not there not on the stormcloak soldier though you know the problem is that there's no fucking clues oh 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 found it there's a dead stormcloak and forsworn I knew it convoy Fuck! What the fuck? Not this, goddammit. Investigate Red Crown Retreat. Well, I found it. It was the first one, of course. Of course. If, uh, fuck it. Fuck, fuck it, of course it was. Claudio is right. Madanak abandoned us. Two more fell to sickness, and three were taken at night. The gods do not listen. Our sacrifices are meaningless. The Norse may have taken our lands, but the pale ones will take our lives if this continues. It pains me to see the little ones, so gone. Hopefully this convoy will have food. Red Crown Retreat is such a silly name. We have not a single crown, only starving rich men. Also, some of them abandoned Madanak or something. Or Madanak abandoned him. Madanak... Madanak abandoned them. After we escaped with them. Stuff. After we escaped from um, Markarth's prison? From Sidna Mine, right, I remember now. Our chieftain Clodio wishes to speak with you. You may enter. He, he wishes to speak with me now? What? Oh, Cure, speak to Clodio. Alright. I don't know if this has something to do um, with me joining the Reachmen and escaping the. Escaping is in the mind, but Good morning morning. I Think I'm still considered a force one. I don't know maybe Who the fuck knows Claudio <laughs> Are you in charge here? Yes, I knew you would come Saw it in the blood It never lies, you know more truth in the dead than the living. The great hero of the Blue Ones. Those who would bury us under their boot heels. Ironic that you're our last hope now. Thank you for staying your hand. As you can see, we're in no condition to resist you. Women, children, and wounded is almost all that remains. I know you saw the body in the altar, as well as your fallen comrades outside. Theirs was a quick death. Ours is a bit slower, I'm afraid. I beg you to hold for only a moment and hear me out before you lay us all low. Mm. Say your peace. We are cursed, and our brethren do nothing to help us. I am prepared to abandon the cause of the Forsworn if you help me redeem our honor. Some time ago, a Stormcloak patrol led by one Rikar ransacked our original home, burning, pillaging, and killing indiscriminately. My own wife was dishonored, maimed. She took her own life later. Shaming us was not enough for a car, though. He took our most precious heirloom. He snatched Petrana's jug from us. It appears as an ordinary vessel, though it is priceless to us. It was used by the great hag, Petrana. She would pour the fresh blood of screaming enemies into the vessel, chanting to the old gods while drinking. Actually, that's not important. Yeah, I didn't want to hear about that. Without the jug, we are lost. The curse weighs heavy on us all. If you manage to return it, my tribe will be in your debt. So is that the Stormcloaks can do more than just make war. Whatever our crimes, we do not deserve death from starvation and the Pale Ones. You just killed some of my comrades, and now you're asking me to kill more? I'm sorry. Truly, I'm tired of death. However, I won't sit by while the little ones starve or become prey for the Pale Ones. The food they guarded was invaluable to us. Would you have done differently? I tell you I would do it again if I had to. Fine. I'll speak to Ricard, but I promise nothing more. Thank you. He is usually in camp near Markarth, but never alone. You will have to contend with his men. Gods preserve you. Retrieve Bertana's jug. The great hag, he said. 
Oh, that was gonna make me laugh a little bit. Fucking really. I still don't remember. Did Ulfric fight against the uh, Forsworn or is he part of the Forsworn? I'm thinking he fought against them. So I don't know if I want to help them. Then against Stormcloak, Imperial, no one is more important than Shayagarad, Daedric Prince of Madness, and Jeez at your service. <sighs> Daedra. Is he up here or something? What the fuck is he doing here? Is he hiding from me? Why hello activity? Heard they're reforming the Dawn Guard. Vampire hunters or something in the old fort near Riften. Might the fuck is he doing in the bushes? Hunt. The fuck is he doing in the motherfucking bushes? What do you want, little elf? What brings you out here? Just celebrating some hard won victories and the spoils that come with them. Wanna nail? Sure you do. Wait. You're Stormblade, aren't you? Saw you in solitude. Wow, it's an honor. Please, sit and drink with us. Surely you have some stories to share. Actually, I'm here about a small bit of property. I understand you have a jug. Wait, you came here for some chunk? I took off some savage French? What's this all about? Who put you up to this? Just hand it over, and I'll be on my way. Listen, I don't care who you are. I'm not handing over what's rightfully mine without a good reason. I have a mind to hold on to it, actually. Just give me the jug now. I don't have to take this. Never Your should have come have here. You off in style. We were supposed to be come allies, on. you motherfucker. No. Never should have come here. here How about no? Why is everyone wielding a great sword? Ricard, you can fuck off the most. Fuckers. Ricard, you can just die if you're not gonna be cooperative. Like a fucking beast. I'm not that. I'm not that much of an asshole now, am I? I am Stormblade. What you gonna do about it, huh? When you're fucking dead! Fucker! Mm. There you go. How'd you become a chief? Supposedly strength and wisdom. But I feel neither strong nor wise. I was wilder in my youth. Not sure how I survived, to be honest. I felt loss, saw injustice everywhere. Thought I could make it right by repaying hatred in kind. It never works. I regret many things. But I will never be ashamed of doing my part to stop the stupid war with the Nords. Why did you sacrifice one to the soldiers? It is our custom, how we honor the gods. I can assure you he was well on his way to the afterlife. It was quick and painless. For some tribes, it is a drawn-out affair. Very nasty. Particularly if the Hagravens are involved. Awful creatures. I thought the Forsworn revered Hagravens. Do all Nords follow the exact same customs? What would you expect different from the Reachmen? The only thing uniting us is hatred for the Nords. We bicker and fight amongst ourselves as much as any people. Probably more. Madanok rallied everyone for a time, but it won't last. You can see all the good it's brought us. We're living in the dirt, dying from starvation for the sake of tradition. It's madness. I revere the gods, but I have no such faith in the plans of men. We will have to move past our hatred of the Nords if we are to prosper. I retrieved the um, Britannia jug. There it is. Vitrana's own vessel. We are forever in your debt. If we are capable, I and what's left of my tribe will gladly fight at your side. 
You have already done so much for us, but I must impose once more. The pale ones who you call the farmer, they are at our throats. They drove us from our first settlement, and now they are on the verge of exterminating us outright. They must be dealt with. You must slay the chieftain. He is the key. Please do this, and our alliance will be absolute. Okay, where is he? Is he in the in a cave or something? I mean, yeah, I think he's in a cave actually. Okay. Need something? Let's -a go. Yes. Let's -a go kill some farmer. It's -a me, Mario. <laughs> well, for once, I'm helping for so we're not killing them. What the fuck is? Oh, he's all the way up there. The farmer chief. Then look at the fucking skeleton. Really? Now I'm invisible. I don't care. <laughs> And nothing can touch me. Wait, can they see me? I'm fucking invisible. How do you? Watch out! They speak. I don't say a goddamn thing. Master difficulty stuff don't have a chance against me for some reason. Why am I even here right now? I'm not gonna pull up a torch. That's the thing though. I'm not gonna pull out a torch. I'm just gonna fight like an idiot in the dark. The fuck is this farmer? Oh wow. It's not him though. Whoa, there's like five of them, isn't there? There's a f warmonger, I think he's a... I don't know. I don't know actually. He, oh, I think he. it's him. He doesn't get staggered at all. Oh my god, Inigo, fucking help me here. Really? We're gonna get butt raped by five... Farm over here. What the fuck, Inigo? Come on! It will help it if you can go through the fucking door. Well, I'm dead now. Okay, what the fuck can I do? I'm gonna use magic now. And I, what the? F Where the fuck did you come from? Are you chasing me? You can fuck up. I almost died because of you motherfuckers last time. I found a note on him. I found a note on him. It's um hastily written note. They came in the night, quiet as shadows and bearing jagged tools with inhuman malice. I thought I knew hate. Hatred for Norse, outlanders. Their hatred for us. It is nothing compared to the furrow, wrath emitting from these wretched beings. Their only pleasure is hearing the agonized plays of captives who they slowly slice into chunks of twitching meat. One by one were tortured into bits, then thrown piece by piece to their hideous pits. Yesterday was an orc. He was brave, but it mattered little. He was forced to watch as they tossed his hands to that cluckling nightmare of a pet. I can't get the screams out. I can't get them out. I can't get them out. The great horde is lurking in the void. I hear them scratching, slithering, scurrying all the time. Like a great mass of frenzies frenzied insects. An army moves beneath us and we're oblivious all the while. They will destroy us all. I have a rock. At least it will be quick. And so he killed himself with a rock. Because those farm are fucking fucked up. How many are up there? What the fuck? Fuck off, goddammit. Fall off. I dare you. Freaking fall off. No! I died three times already. Just fucking give it up. Is there one more? I think there's one more. He's all the way up there being a little bitch. Come on. 
Really? I don't want to fall off again. Your face would frighten a orca. I want to hit you. There. Inigo got him. Jeez. Was that everything? Please said it'd be everything. I saw no farmer boss. Oh god. There's more. What isn't there? What, where do they fucking keep farming from? If Inigo falls down here, he's fucked. You will not live to regret that. Well, the chieftain's dead, but they keep coming. They keep coming. I'm gonna burn you to death. Well, now the chieftain, chieftain's dead. Fucking god. That took 50 tries. Oh my fucking god. I'm out of here. Hmm? The former chieftain is dead. You are much more than a simple storm cloak, my friend. You have saved us from the starvation and the depredations of the pale ones. So long as I draw breath. My tribe will follow a path of reconciliation with the Nords. The time of the sword has ended. I thank you. We all thank you. You're welcome. Speak with Rolf. Well, time to go hey, back. Don't tell me what to do, child. Child! I'm finally an adult. Don't tell me what the fuck to do. <laughs> I've been an adult. For one year now. I'm a strong independent black woman. I mean, I'm a strong independent. I mean, I don't fucking know what I am anymore. Well, I need to go there anyway, so let's go. Let me guess, there's more jobs that involve me dying. Well, it's about time I died once. Hello. I ended up helping a small group of Forsworn. They claim they want peace now. You'll excuse me if I'm a little skeptical, but, uh,. I find it hard to take the word of Forsworn Savages at face value. I'm going to trust you on this, but if I find out that group is causing trouble, if you just jeopardize people's lives because of your high-minded altruism, then I will settle with you later. We understand each other. That aside, check with me if you want more work. Whatever happens, I'm not the one who's gonna be dead. Hello. Um, so how did you end up a Stormcloak? Signed up with my family. Didn't want to look back years from now and regret not doing my part. How about you? I believe the Stormcloaks are Skyrim's best option for stopping the Thalmor. Really? Do you know what kind of resources the Outmerit Dominion has? It's going to take more than raw enthusiasm. Well, I wanted to choose the second option, so I guess you have an odd accent. It's a product of sailing with my cousin, Andrik Bloodaxe. Most of his crew were Sverd and Agerheim. We lived among them for years. The Sverd are savages, but damn competent sailors. It's a shame the clans are always at each other's throats. We could use their longships. Much about them is strange, including the accent. You don't want them for an enemy. That's the god. How can he not get an accent? I mean, it's a mod. So, Audric is a good friend of yours? Audric is the best kind of friend. He tells me when I'm wrong, even when I don't want to hear it. I know he's family, but he's closer than most family. A lot of my family I prefer to stab. Audric is crazy. Uh, I mean, crazier than anyone, in fact, uh, but loyal. Audric doesn't have many friends, for good reason, but those that he has will do anything for him, including sticking his boot right up to her ass. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, what will we do after the fighting is done? What do you mean after? I mean, like, after we've secured Skyrim and the Thalmor are no longer a threat? Well, uh, I'm not sure. I love hunting. Always have. I like the outdoors. Being alone, I don't like being with people I know. Most people don't want to admit that, but I like uh, solitude. If I had my brothers, I'd just 
live in some cabin up in the woods and hunt some deer every now and then, read, and uh, I don't know, maybe other things. What kind of other things? The kind of things you don't freely share with uh, fellow storm cloaks. I'm going to tell you, but I swear to tell us if you should tell anyone I'll cut your throat. I mean, I'm not joking. I, I like to paint. Oh. I love the vistas and the views outside. I like to sit up on the mountains and paint the world as I see it. Obviously, it's not the kind of hobby you talk about when you're supposed to be a uh, bloodthirsty uh, storm cloak officer. The natural world fascinates me, though. I love animals. I mean, I hunt them, but just the bare minimum to survive and to kind of keep myself sharp. Besides, if I wasn't a good hunter, the, uh, it would be one more thing for the Nord Nords to criticize me about. The Nord Nords? They'd say the breath inside was coming out and that uh, I was weak because of it. So, I hunt the animals. But I respect them, no question. No other friends beside Audric. I've had lots of friends, but most are dead or maimed. It's just how it goes with war. Had a thing for another Stormcloak girl when I was lower rank. But she wouldn't marry a half Breton, much less a bastard, so... She married some noble. He was a craven. I challenged him to a duel, chopped his head off, and she cursed my name. That was the end of it, so... No Audric is about my only good friend left. Well... That's a tragic backstory. Um... I'm, for, I'm ready for the next assignment. For all its faults, the Empire had a sound legal system that offered a uniform code of law for all of Skyrim. Now, there are problems. For instance, the revival of the home game, also known as trial by combat. It is a traditional method to resolve disputes between Nords. It had been relatively rare under the Empire, really only used by independent Nords like the Spare. However, it is apparently back in fashion. A man named Gunnar has been roaming Skyrim, challenging Nords to duels. By doing so, he's able to intimidate people into giving up their assets. Only a handful have faced Gunnar, and they all perished. He is abusing the tradition and mocking our laws. He has to be stopped. What we need is proof that there is justice in the home game. You will prove this by challenging Gunnar to a duel and defeating him. He is rumored to be loitering at the Nightgate Inn. If he's a traditionalist, it shouldn't take much to goad him. Good luck. A new quest. Deal with Gunnar. Why do you people have so much names that start with Gunnar? Let's go do that and then we'll start breaking the ice. There is no need to push. Unless he has even more assignments. Um, shit. I'm gonna ask him about the other job so I don't have to come here ten times. Yes. What's the next job? Not many know this, but Ulfric is close to cementing a defensive pact with Hammerfell at this moment. I can't overstate its importance. While the Red Guards are warming to the idea of a pact, they have asked for our help in dealing with a certain problem that is beyond their reach. Seems that before the Dominion withdrew, one Talmor officer named Utranil committed a number of atrocities against civilians in Hammerfell. Sadly, Utranil was never brought to justice. In fact, he now captains a Talmor scouting vessel, the Wizard's Whisper. Ooh. Coincidentally, some Nord fishermen reported seeing that same vessel trapped in ice north of the coast. See where I'm going with this? Hammerfell wants Orthranil dead. We can have no witnesses though. If word gets out, we could end up in a war that we're not ready for yet. Leave no witnesses, understand? Not a single one. See to this we'll be on our way to an alliance with Hammerfell. Good luck. Thanks. Speak with 
Gord the well spoken. <laughs> How well spoken is he? Is he as well spoken as me? I, I don't think so. Maybe I'm well spoken to begin with. Aight! I explained the strong was on the verge of signing an important pact with Hammerfell. I have to meet him first, but first let's do a familiar foes. Let's deal with Gunnar first. I like the new solitude. Okay, where should we go? Where Gunnar is? Speak with. Nope, that's not him. He's at um right at um. He said the Night Gate in. Every time I look at the Night Gate in, I want to say Night and go in, but you know, it's not about that. If there was a Night and go in, we'd be screwed. Oh. He's gonna. Thanks for watching. A like and a comment is always appreciated. But if you want to go the extra mile, then subscribe as well. I upload daily gaming videos, so it'd be in your best interest to subscribe if you like them.